What's up, you guys? Ethan's Mystical Child here, coming to you with a pick a card. Hope all is well. Whenever you see this reading, hopefully you are in good spirits. And take what upon leave the rest. The title today is What is the Current Gossip on You? So, we have three pounds. Hold on for a second. Okay, so yeah, um, I have three pals here. The timestamp is going to be in the description box and the message box. I had to get your little cards together. I forgot to get your cards together. So, you can either pick from the deck or you could pick the doors. So, I'm going to show you the doors for pile one. This is one door. This is the other door. And why are you going to pick the door? Because they have messages and little messages that you need to hear that the universe god divine whoever you believe in needs to they think you need to hear it because that's what i um pulled them for for whatever messages you need to hear so this is the card for pal two i'm a little bit all over the place i just finished eating a cheeseburger and french fries seasoned french fries and they were everything it tastes good as hell or, yeah, I'm not going to say that. This is the doorway for pile number two. This is the other doorway. And coincidentally, every deck have two doorways. So this is the doorway for pile number three. This would be the other doorway. And this would be your card. So shout out to my subscribers. New and old, what's popping with you guys? Again, hopefully this is useful to you. Take what apply, leave the rest. This gossip doesn't make it true. So if you're a visitor, welcome. Return to visitors, welcome back. See you in power one. Okay, power one. If you pick this door, or if you pick this door, or if you pick this deck, this is your pile. This is your reading. Shout out to you guys. Hope all is well. Take what apply, leave the rest. Today's topic is, what is the current gossip on you? Remember, it's gossip. Doesn't make it true, although it can be true. So, again, take what apply, leave the rest. Shout out to my subscribers, new and old, for coming through, holding the vibes, and creating the vibes. If you are a visitor, welcome. Returning visitors, welcome back. So, I'm going to get to the messages on your cards, and then we're going to start the reading. If you pick this door, this is a message for you. It says, walkabout. You discover your path and sacred walkabouts. The trees are your people. The earth is your tribe. In indigenous lessons, you find the will to survive. Some of you could be Indian or have um, indigenous cultures or not indigenous culture, have indigenous um, ancestors or background. But it's about um, this, this message here is about discovering yourself, tapping into earth tapping into mother nature and finding yourself some of you could have had um no i'm not gonna say that if you have picked this door it says a note of love seek different seasons and center into the unknown when love is the focus foundation and goals blessed is the body mind and soul Okay, so what I'm getting from this, when you, um, it says when you, no, when love is the focus, foundation, and the goal, blessed is the body, mind, and soul. It reminds me of happy wife, happy life. So, yeah, take that message for what it was worth for you guys, and let's get right to it. Let's see what is the gossip on you guys. Um, I was going to do this reading different, but then I said, nope. I'm going to kind of do it the original style that I used to do the readings. So, the deck is already prepped. I don't know why I'm shuffling them. But, working energy into it. Gatekeepers, what is the gossip on pile number one? What is the current gossip on pile number one? <laughs> Gosh. Um... The current gossip on you guys, uh, you could be somebody that is, this is the page of Swords that came out. Somebody's name could be Greg. Now, I'm going to give you, because um, everything cannot be positive. So, 
I'm going to give you the good and the bad in this pile. So, again, take with a plot and leave the rest. With the Page of Swords, the Page of Swords is somebody who likes to gossip a lot. Somebody who, um, who love mix-up. Somebody who also is like a silver-tongued devil because they lie a lot. Um, this card is about uh, manipulation as well. Yeah, let's clarify that, why that came out. Clarify the page of swords. Why is this... The star. Yeah, some of you guys are toxic and you need to heal yourself. It's the gossip. I don't know, you know, take it for what it's worth. With the star here, some of you guys like to drink a lot. Some of you are, what, what I would say, have a bad reputation. You're rough around the edges. And... You like to fight a lot for some of you guys. Some of you, you, um, this is, wow. For some of you guys, with the, how does this come out so, like, this? <laughs> to me, it's kind of wild. But, let me try to get some goodness out of this. Some of you, there's no real, yeah, some, oh gosh, there's no real good way of saying this. Um, I feel like scrapping this reading, to be honest, but I'm not going to scrap it. I'm just going to keep going with it to see where this goes. Clarify. Matter of fact, let me come out of these real quick. Real quick. Just real quick to see what I'm dealing with right here. Clarify this page of swords. What is the gossip on power one? Why is this page of swords here? You have self-love intentions and creation. With this star here, the page of swords, this energy here, some of you need to, the gossip on you is you need to heal yourself. You need some self-love. You need to have intentions when it, you need to be more intentional when it comes to healing yourself, healing whatever toxicity this is with this page of swords. Some of you need to mature. I know this is not going too well, so, so far, the energy that's coming out is not going too well, but if this doesn't um, resonate with you, you don't have to click off just so quickly, because I have more oracles to get through, but I, I want to see something. Clarify this star. Why is this star here? What is the gossip on power one? Some of you have decisions. Some of you have a decision to stay or leave, stay toxic, or... Stay toxic and immature and, and very rough around the edges. Somebody with a, um, a bad reputation. You could stay that way or you could actually heal yourself and have self and love. Self love for yourself. Have more intentions on healing yourself and having more hope and inspiration in your life. Because the star is all about hope and inspiration. Somebody here could be uh, Aquarius as well. But with the star here, the gossip on you guys is like... Some of you need renewed hope, or you need to find the right path. You need to find some willpower and some inspiration to start healing yourself, it seems. Because with this decision card here, it's like you guys have a decision. A decision that's going to be, it's like you caught between two things, staying toxic and not being toxic. Yeah. Clarify this, um... It says fate, divine intervention, divine tour. Yeah, divine, um, it's a detour, divine intervention. This is like the will of fortune. So the gossip on you is like, really, you guys need to heal yourself. You need to start looking into maturing yourself, getting serious about yourself. The will is starting to turn. The, the universe is trying to uh, get you guys' attention with this star and with this towel card here. You guys really need to change your ways i don't this is clarify this page of swords this is the venus card so okay somebody could be a libra somebody could be a taurus somebody could be a leo somebody could be a gemini somebody could be a uh, aries libra again a taurus or a scorpio now let's bring this let's dial this back um 
with this page of swords and this love offer, the gossip on you is like somebody that's young and toxic want to give you a love offer. They want to bring you a love offer. If they're not young, if they are older in age, they act young. They are kind of confrontational. This person think you are very pretty. They want to be romantic with you. Some of them feel like they have an emotional bond with you. But again, take it for what it's worth because this person is um, doesn't seem like they quite mature. I'm going to start clarifying. Let's clarify it. Clarify the page of swords. What is the current gossip on power one? It says, my mother left me as a child. I have trust issues. So it's, it, the energy is really not changing. Somebody here, you guys, whoever resonates with this, this is the gossip on you. It's like you have trauma, you have inner childhood wounds that you need to heal, that you're not healing. This is bleeding over in your love relationships. It's like you guys are being very defensive and, and defensive and tyrannical in your love relationships and you need to heal this. Clarify this page of swords. What is the gossip on this page of swords? It says, my mother made me codependent when it comes to relationships. Somebody could be Aquarius, Gemini, and a Libra, like I said. So this is just getting in the mind of this um, page of swords, is what these cards is. It says, I wish there was more people like you and the world you're priceless so the gossip on you you have a page of swords in your life that i already explained how this person is they feel like you're priceless they feel like you are somebody that they have romantic feelings for somebody that they like they of course they like you if they have romantic feelings they want to bring you emotion the emotional offer but this person is like it says i'm looking to build or at least date somebody who is secure in themselves so this could be you guys saying it to this person. This is the the current gossip on you that you are having love issues and you have a love issues with somebody is immature or the gossip on you could be that you are this immature person. You want to bring a love offer to somebody. You have decisions. You have the uh, opportunity to grow up or not to grow up. It's a divine intervention here. It's right here. Divine intervention and a star right underneath it. You guys need to heal. You guys need to change your ways especially when it comes to your love because this is where it, it's it seems to be geared to your love relationships i want to use your deck more but the deck you pick but hold on i'm called not to use that deck to be honest clarify the page of vulnerability some of you guys need to be more vulnerable some of you are um are stuck in your ways it's like you spoil you you don't want to grow up but you need to grow up it's important for you to grow up it's like you is your way or the highway some of you guys have a problem with being vulnerable when it comes to relationships tell me more about this page of swords what is the current gossip on this page of swords shit it says interlude sexing rendezvous rebound yeah this is yeah i i can't i can't say it anymore you guys need to heal this this is the current gossip for you you guys are stuck in rendezvous you love rendezvous it's a rebound here in interlude so interlude rebound and rendezvous all states that you guys are not committed you scared to commit you need to heal yourself the universe is giving you a chance to heal yourself especially to show yourself self-love if if not if not to anybody heal yourself because yeah, this is like a hot mess, if you will. Um, okay, I'm not going to beat on this anymore because you got the message from that. If that's your, um, if that's your deal. Let's see how I can change. Let's go to the money. Go to some money. See what's going on with your finances. And then I'm going to cut out of here. This jumped out. Unexpected finances and saving money. So some of you guys could be saving money and some of you are going to get unexpected finances. That would be cool. What is the current gossip on um, Power One? If you are um, um, saving money, you are making headway. That's a good thing for you. You are slowly making headway. Some of you, you, um, have, you are very creative. You want to, it's like a light bulb moment going off in your head. Like you want to create something. 
you saving money to try to help fund you creating whatever this is. Some of you are going to get unexpected money. Some of you could be in a health care. Um, you could have a health. You could be in a health care. Why well, always trip over this word? You could have a career as a somebody in health care. Nurse, doctors, therapist, dentist, anybody. Some of you guys um, with this insurance, some of you, uh, some of you are could be sick with this star here, unexpected expenses and in insurance. Some of you should be saving up money just in case anything like that does happen, because it is here a little bit that some of you could be having um, money issues. Some of you are looking for a job as well, and you saving your money as um, you are looking for a job some of you if you are looking for a new job if you had insurance on your job some of you your insurance is going to run out for you on your job so you need to kind of like get the jump start on that and try to find a new job tap into some of your creative abilities if you need money that's going to um help fund you guys if you don't have a job and if you are waiting to get a job um Let's clarify the star, and then I'm going to pal two. Clarify the star. What is the cost, current gossip here? Some of you could be um, could like to drink a lot, and you're trying to kill that as well. It says, I just wish. I just dream and wish for everything. Let me have you. Your family won't like me. So you guys with this star, like I said, you need to heal yourself because it's somebody that you want to be with. And you feel like their family don't want you around. Your family don't like, their family don't like you. Or vice versa. And you dream about everything. You have hope. You have inspiration. Some of you. And some of you need to find this. And yeah, the universe is trying to co-create with you. It's a divine intervention. They want you to start looking within. So, and you have to have strength. Let go of this ego. Let go of the ego if this is your issue. So, if you've gotten something from this, like and subscribe. I'm going off to POW um, 2. And those messages that I gave to you in the beginning, some of these, those messages are going to go for this reading for some of you guys. So, again, like and subscribe if you have gotten something from this. On the bottom of this, it says you're living a lie. I'm living a lie. Not strong enough to change this. This is why the star card is here. Look within yourself. If you're going to bet on anybody, bet on yourself. Start showing yourself some self-love. So, till next time in Tarot Land. How to, if you pick this deck, or if you pick this doorway, or this doorway, this is your reading. Shout out to you guys. Hope all is well. And the title today is, What is the Current Gossip on You? Take what apply, leave the rest. And shout out to my subscribers, new and old. What is popping with you guys? Hopefully you in good spirits when you see this reading. And remember, it's gossip. Doesn't make it true, but it very well can be true. If you're a visitor, welcome. Returning visitors, welcome back. And let's get with the reading. I'm going to read the messages on the back of your cards or your doors, basically, that you pick. So, if you pick this door, this is your message. It says, freedom flows. Don't hold yourself back from worldly freedom. Dream grand things for divine, sacred reasons. So, dream big for the right reasons. Do not dream big for the wrong reasons. And don't hold yourself back. So, if you want to do something, do it. If you want to start something, start it. If you want to create something, create it. But do it for the right reasons. If you pick this door, sorry, it's in reverse. If you pick this door, it says deeper. You are not finished. You are not yet done. Dig deeper and deeper. The best is yet to come. Hold on, hold on. Pass this card on. So you see how that goes with one another? Dig deep. Whatever you feel like giving up on, don't give up on it because you're close. You're pretty close. So again, if you're going to bank on anybody, I was telling Power One that because Power One, that, that, that Power was, um, it was a bit much. It was. So yeah, if you're going to bet on anybody, bet on yourself, you know? Don't give up on yourself. If you have dreams and inspirations and aspirations, Bring them forward. Do not let anything ham hamper you, you know? Let's see what it is going on with you, though. Gatekeepers, what is the current gossip on, pal? 
It says the Page of Wands. So the Page of Wands is somebody that's passionate. Somebody that is ready to... Ready to, what would I say, seize... Seize the opportunity. So again, whatever opportunity you're working on, really work on it. But some of them... Um, don't, don't give up on it, is what I want to say. Some of you guys, um, the current gossip on you is like you have ego, though. You have big ego. And then, um, hold on for a second. Hold on, hold on. My brain is all over the place. I told Power One, I just finished eating a cheeseburger and some um, seasoned french fries. It was very good. But, like, I feel stuffed and everything. So, yeah, you, um, it's time for you to seize the moment. If you're ready to work on something with this page of wands, work on it. People, the gossip about you, the current gossip, is that you're very confident. You're focusing on what you're trying to grow, what you're trying to bring to reality, whatever you're manifesting, and you're not focused on anything else. Um, for others of you, I'm not going to say that for others of you. I'm just going to let that play out because I don't want to gear it to that way. What is the current gossip on this page of wands energy? For pile number two. That was, um, that was, uh, what I just, the card that popped out but didn't really drop. What was it? Where did it end? It wasn't that far. Some of you feel guarded. Some of you are feeling guarded and vulnerable. The ancestor guys want to come out. So your ancestors and guys are trying to help you. And again, I don't want this energy to bleed off from power one. But again, it seems like the um, energy here is that you guys are guarded. You're feeling vulnerable. Your ancestors are trying to help you. Some of you guys are trying to look within to get inner inspection. Could be for whatever you're trying to work on. If it's a project, it could be a relationship. Look, Venus love all for one to come out. But I'm not going to take it um, because it didn't, it, didn't just, it didn't drop. What is the current gossip on... Pound number two, clarify this page of wands. You have the four of wands. Something's going on with your stability or a relationship you're in. With this four of wands and page of wands. There's some conflict going on. There's some confusion going on. There's some, um, it seems like you could be in a relationship that's not really working for you guys. And you guard it and you feel vulnerable. You're trying to look within yourself to get some um, introspection, some help from your guides. The Ace of Cups, what I just said, came out. Some of you guys, I'm not going to say that. I was called to say some of you guys need to look within yourself and have some self-love. But I don't know what's going on here. Clarify this Ace of Cups. I don't want the energy from Pal, um, Pal want to come in just for me to put it in it says backup plan so some of you guys are guarded again you're vulnerable you're trying to look within yourself with this page of wands you're passionate something is going on in your your stability with your relationships the ace of cups came out and what came out with the ace of cups is backup plan some of you guys could be married and you have somebody else you want to be with or some of you want to break up in your marriage or break up your relationship and go to the person that you have on your mind um I don't. Hold on for a second. Clarify this Ace of Cups. What is the current gossip on pile number two? It says left you hanging. Okay, so somebody um, left you hanging. It says no closure contact left on red. So somebody you was in a relationship with, somebody you're supposed to have stability with, some of you could have been married or engaged, some of you could have been left at the altar. Somebody left you hanging. Somebody ghosted you guys. Um, clarify this page of wands. So now I'm going to say what I was going to say. With this page of wands, I want to say somebody's um, too interested in pollinating other people's trees. They're too interested in having sexual escapades. And they, um, they're neglecting themselves. They're not showing themselves self-love. They Some of them are running themselves rampant. They're giving out their energy to all these backup plans and... All of the sexual escapades that they have. Somebody is for the streets. Somebody's community dick or community vagina. It says, um, psycho, crazy ex, obsessed, won't let go. 
So somebody um, X here won't let them go. This page of wands. They're very obsessed. They're thinking about their penis when they think of you. They, <laughs> they want to make something grow, but they only want to make something grow because of, um, when I say make something grow, like a relationship. But their penis, when they think about you, their penis get hard. They want to have sex with you. It says round and round, cycles, triggers, lessons. So the current gossip on you is that you're on a comic wheel. You're going through comic lessons. Somebody ghosted you. And whoever ghosted you, you want to be back with them. Because now they are secure, confident. They're a boss bitch. They focused on their career. They're a queen rising. They're a queen bee for some of you. And it says reckless love, reckless sex. So somebody was reckless with you guys. It's the, um... It's the current gossip on you, and they want you back. Whoever they in a relationship, they don't is not making them happy because they're on a comic wheel, and they just realize that they're going in a cycle, cycle after cycle after cycle. Somebody have a toxic lifestyle. They like to party, drink, self medicate themselves to drown themselves away from this. They like to live in a moment. They don't think future for the future. Somebody works for Uber Eats. Somebody have a side hustle doing Uber Eats. Somebody's stubborn, arrogant, arrogant, stubborn, arrogant. I'm saying this. This is not. It says stubborn here, but they're arrogant. I feel like they're ignorant. They let their vices get the better of them. It's their way or the highway. This person likes to smoke cigarettes. They could be an Aries. They could walk around with a big dick energy. But this is the current gossip on you guys. So, if it applies to you, like and or subscribe. And I will see you in Power 3. If you go to Power 3, and if not, I'll see you in the next tower reading. Until next time. Okay, Power number 3. If you pick this deck, or if you pick this door, or this door, this is your reading. Shout out to you guys. Hope all is well. When you see this, hopefully you in good spirits. And this reading is, what is the current gossip on you? Remember, it's gossip, doesn't make it true, although it very well can be true. Shout out to my subscribers, new and old, what is popping with you guys? If you're a visitor, welcome. Returning visitors, welcome back. I'm going to get right into it. But before we get into it, I'm going to give you the message off the door that you pick. If you pick this door, the message is, begin here. Do not fear what travel brings, my dear. The moment is yours. Begin now begin here pass this card on so pass this message on so don't have no fear because whatever's going on here i don't read these bef beforehand but whatever's ha happening here you need to be um moving on you need to be traveling you need to be living in the moment so if you pick this door your message is the sacred lotus compassion and action the chosen tool i see now the lotus and your spirit's jewel. Some of you, you're using compassion with people. You're using compassion with the situation or whoever this is that you're dealing with. It seems like. Um, because there was betrayal here. There was a painful ending. And it was a tower moment. Something, some upheaval happened real quick, unexpectedly. That caused this to happen. Caused <laughs> whatever this is to happen. Let's get right to it though. So the current gossip on you is that you are the queen of wands. You're somebody that's very sensual, sexy, passionate, somebody happy-go-lucky, somebody that's very successful, but you're sitting on your throne, and you're looking forward in life. You're not worrying about nobody in the past. You're not worrying about this page of wands that's stalking you, because there's a page of wands stalking you. And they're looking at the situation as bleak. This person is trying to get to you, but they can't get to you because they realize there is a tower moment in between you two. So it's really looking like this if you see it down. You see how this person is looking at that tower moment? This person know if they come to you, there is a tower moment. So the gossip on you is that you're not taking no shit from nobody. You have somebody stalking you. Somebody you could have potentially walked away from or they walked away from you. If they did walk away from you, they're upset that they walked away from you because you are the queen rising. You are the Empress Junior, the Nine of Pentacles. You look good. You smell good. You delve in luxury things. You're very opulent. You're very successful. Some of you could like to drink wine or you have a, a business that delves in wine or you could just like 
have a partner in wine or something. This person, the um, current gossip on you is that you're juggling a lot of things between your personal life and your um, your home life and your work life, your career life, and you're managing it. You're doing very well. Sila, shit. I just felt like that. So let's start clarifying this a little bit. Clarify this three. Damn, this one. Exclusive. The gossip on you is that you are exclusive. Your love is exclusive. People want to be around you. They want to get to you, but they can't get to you. Why? Because you're sitting on your throne and you're exclusive. Let's see something real quick. What caused this tower for power three? You have people young or young-minded that wants to come to you. They spying on you. They trying to figure out what's going on. There's a herm the hermit on the bottom. Let me see something because no card wanted to come out of there. Clarify this tower. What caused this tower for power three? Karmic ties, a karmic relationship. So the universe broke this up. There was a tower, some very emotional um, roller coaster, or some some big emotional um, uh, situation happened that caused this to break up. Clarify this page of wands. Why is this page of wands stalking pile pile three? They wish to be with you. You are they wish. They could be stuck in a comic tie, or they are the comic. But they have a wish to be with your ass. This is the current gossip. You are very fiery. You're looking good over here. You're sitting on your throne. You're very powerful. You 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 only um give people energy. People who could get your energy is people that you are um you are in, like at good standards with, like your friends or whoever you deem that's. Worthy to be around you. Those are the only people who could be around you. Clarify this on um, three of swords. What caused this three of swords? What is the current gossip? You are divine feminine. Like I said, you're over here looking good. You're the empress junior. Some of you are the empress. Some of you are clearing your energy. You're saging. You're balancing yourself. Somebody going through legal issues there. <clears throat> I said legal issues there. So I don't know wherever they at. You are somewhere opposite from this person for some of you. You are not going through these issues with this person. This is going on behind your back. They're going through court for criminal, paternity, divorce, child support, traffic, tickets. This All hell is breaking loose in this person's life. And gossip is, you sitting pretty, looking good, and they devastated. They want to be with you. They can't be with you. You turned your back. You said goodbye to this person. And this is the gossip. And people are getting shock news behind you. And some of you could very well be the Divine Masculine, because the Divine Masculine came out as well as the Divine Feminine. Clarify the Hermit, what is the current gossip? You are my everything. I'm too afraid to talk to you. So this little immature person, no matter their age, they think you are the everything, because you're sitting here looking good. They're too scared to come back and talk to you. I told you, when they look at you, they see a towel moment. They worry about you a lot, too. Like, and subscribe. Till next time.